the story of the Statue of Liberty. Okay? We said that the genre of the story is narrative non-fiction. That means narrative, it narrates a story. Non-fiction, it means it's not imagination. It truly happens. Okay, so it gives information about real people and events in the form of a story. Okay, let's see why do why do we have symbols that represents freedom? Let's read the story together. The Statue of Liberty stands on an island in New York in New York Harbor. She is a beautiful sight of all who pass by her. Each year millions of visitors ride the ferry out to the island. They climb to the top of the statue to enjoy the lovely view. Here the most important part is in in this paragraph is that where where is the place of the Statue of Liberty? The Statue of Liberty stands on an island in New York Harbor, okay? Okay, let's complete. A young French sculptor named Frederick Auguste Bartholdi visited America in 1871 when he saw Bidlow's Island in New York Harbor. He knew it was just the right place for a statue he wanted to build. Here, exactly what is the name of the island that here the name of the island is Bartholdi Island not Bartholdi sorry Bidlow's Island in New York Harbor Harbor okay Harbor means like like the beach okay here Bartholdi had created many other statues and monuments but this one was to be very special why it's special let's see it was to be a present from the people of france to the people of america as a remember remembrance of the old friendship between the two countries okay so these the most important three what three parts exactly where is it the statue of liberty and in new york exactly in bidlow's uh, island why it's important and it's so special because it's present a gift from people of france to people of what of america here when Bartholdi got back to Paris, he made sketches and some small models. The statue would be a woman whom he would call Liberty. She would be a symbol of the freedom in the new world. She would hold a lamp in her raised hand to welcome people who came to America. She would be liberty enlightening the world. So here, the most important part here is that we ask ourselves, what's the first step? What's the first Step. What's the first step 
to build um, to build this um, this statue that he made sketches he drew sketches and somewhat small models so before you do something big it's good to do like symbols models okay for this thing so you you organize it mm -hmm. that's the same thing that part told you do that sorry okay here also she would be a symbol so if i ask you huh so this statue the 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 statue of liberty is a symbol of what or symbolizes what what does it, what does it symbol for so it's symbol of the freedom in the new world okay it also let's describe its shape or what it's look like what what she look like because actually it's a woman um she would hold the lamp in her raised hand to welcome people who came to america so here are the most important uh, ideas that what is the first step that partordi did to build the statue is that he made the sketches and some small models what does the statue of liberty symbolizes for it's a symbol for what for freedom so the statue of liberty is a symbol for what for freedom excellent uh, in the new world